Gently bring your left knee to the ground. Feel free to cushion your knee if you have any discomfort. Take a moment to just connect with your breath and literally the back side of your body. Feel a sense of trust and surrender as you just pause here and connect to presence. Maintain your thighs and knees into the earth to direct the energy or the focal point of the back bend into your heart instead of your low back. Inhale and reach back one hand or two hands at a time for your feet or ankles. Resist pushing right away and just connect with your breath. Inhale and allow the shoulders to lengthen up towards the ears and exhale drawing the shoulder blades deep on the back. Inhale, make sure you're not clenching your buttocks and exhale, press back mindfully through your shins and feet for bow pose, Danurasana. Continue to root your knees and thighs into the floor and exhale, use the power in your inner thighs and feet to press back and expand more deeply the heart. Open your throat so that the neck feels delightful and the heart can open. Take another few breaths here. and your universal connection. With puffy kidneys, slowly fold into pigeon pose. Place your forearms parallel to the earth, shoulder width apart, palms spread. Inhale and bring the knees into the chest. Lift the hips off the earth and bring the hands onto the back. Shift your thighs so that they come parallel to your face. Press the upper arm bones into the earth and extend the spine up by engaging your core and lengthening the tailbone up to the sky. See if you can just be still in the space. Resist any fidgeting and surrender. Shavasana allows us an opportunity to feel the deep vibrations within that free us and allow the heart to expand. Feel the universal spaciousness that is in all things, that is in all of us. <laughs> 